Hi there guys, so Anthony Joshua has finished his camp in the UK and he arrived in Saudi Arabia yesterday and he first got to Saw, the stadium where he will attempt to exact revenge on Andy Ruiz Jr. and attempt to reclaim his world unified heavyweight titles. Now obviously Anthony Joshua touched down in Saudi Arabia only yesterday, so that means he will have two weeks until the fight so that he can become accustomed to the surroundings where he's going to be fighting and obviously he can get used to the arena that he will be fighting in and attempting to reclaim his titles. Now obviously Anthony Joshua has been cutting a bit of weight, maybe not too much, I don't think it will be too drastic. Obviously it looks worse than it probably is because he does look thinner, but picture angles and things like that, everything comes into it. He won't necessarily be ridiculously lighter than he usually is. He'll be about 17 stone, maybe a little bit under, but he won't be too much lighter than he was last time, I don't think anyway. And obviously Andy Ruiz Jr. also said he was going to be lighter. Maybe that was a bit of a mind game because he's only three pounds lighter. Perhaps he's gained a bit of muscle and lost a bit of fat. That might be why there's not that much weight difference. Because if you see the before and after pictures of Andy Ruiz Jr., you can see he's a little bit more toned. He's not as flubby and as fleshy as he normally is. So Andy Ruiz Jr. will be different going into this fight, much as Anthony Joshua is. Now, obviously, Andy Ruiz Jr. is anticipating a harder fight than the first time. If he does not, then he is a bit delusional because... I believe Anthony Joshua came off the boil a bit last time. I'm not saying all of these rumours are true, you know, all of the excuses, but I'm just saying that Anthony Joshua wasn't fighting the way he normally fights at all. And in this fight, Anthony Joshua will be a stark contrast to how he was last time. So that means Anthony Joshua will be completely different and Andy Ruiz Jr. must prepare for a different Anthony Joshua than he got last time. Because Anthony Joshua is wise to Andy Ruiz Jr. now. He knows exactly what he is about. He knows he's going to be a nice guy in the build-up, but as soon as that first bell goes, it's fight time. And Andy Ruiz Jr. is in there to get rid of Anthony Joshua. So Anthony Joshua must do the same. Now, obviously, this arena has only just been finished, I think. I mean, maybe there's a few more things that need doing, but the progress of the arena is incredible. It's surprising how far it's come since Frank Smith uploaded a video showing the arena. And now, obviously, Eddie Hearn has uploaded a video showing Anthony Joshua looking at the arena for the first time. And the difference is incredible. They work extremely fast over there and you have to give them credit. It's like a modern day Coliseum. It's like a gladiator arena. And that's where Anthony Joshua will attempt to regain his world unified heavyweight titles on December 7th. Guys, what are your thoughts on this? Anthony Joshua is finally in Saudi Arabia. Two weeks to go until the fight. The clock is ticking. What are your thoughts on the fight? Who do you believe has the advantage? And what are your thoughts on the new arena? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Click the thumbs up and subscribe if you are new. Thanks guys.